Hey, welcome back guys. Today we'll be looking at Blue Lock chapter 223. Are you ready to die? The chapter starts off with Snuffy receiving the ball after Isagi and Kaiser's block. Thanks to Snuffy's design, Uber shift up to a higher gear. Facing the world's best tactician, Bastard Munich are forced on the back foot as they struggle to repel Uber's relentless attack. Aiku, Nico and Lorenzo are getting ready to crush Bastard and Isagi realizes that the second wave is incoming. Snuffy runs towards the box and Bastard's defense is barely hanging on. How will they defend the next attack? Even Isagi's metavision is failing. What kind of brain does Snuffy have? Snuffy passes it to Lorenzo as he was marked by Raichi. This is a different attack pattern. If Isagi charges in without knowing what they'll do, he'll obviously get shut down. If that's the case, he has to observe and analyze Snuffy's world-class tactics. Lorenzo passes it over to Drago, but Raiji is putting in that work. Ubers are attacking the space on the left. This time they'll use the entire width of the field to break them down with crosses. But while everyone is moving to deal with the cross, Snuffy is slipping through behind their blind spots. Drago crosses the ball and Isagi thinks it's over. Gagamaru can see this play as it happens, as Snuffy is wide open. But Kaiser gets to him and tries to block him off, saying he is able to see Snuffy. He just sees it. Snuffy jumps up and headers it, right over Kaiser, who stands there, stunned. Even though Kaiser had a body on him, he could jump that high. That's crazy balance and hold up play. The ball goes right across, passing Ness who is in the middle of the box. Nico receives it but he gets marked by Noah. As he says, it's all going according to plan. This is Snuffy's design. He does a quick back heel pass to the oncoming Baro, who seems to be in a great position. Bastard are really hanging on by a thread as Isagi slide tackles Baro kicking the ball out of play. Of course, Baro is pissed off as Isagi stopped their attack. The only reason Bastard are holding on is because Noah, Isagi and Kaiser can read their attacks. Since the three of them are covering the team's blind spots, they haven't conceded. But even so, they are barely hanging on. Right now, Isagi can't see them stealing the ball and counter-attacking, as Snuffy is completely different from Prince and Lavinio. Unlike them, he's not focused on getting his own goal. Snuffy is making sure that the rest of the team follows their tactics. No wonder he can outread Isagi's metavision. Since he's watching over the game, it's easy to contain someone who's trying to steal the ball and score. Isagi has to take the step and make Snuffy react to him. If he can't see further into the future than Snuffy, he can't win. Noah asks Isagi, is Snuffy is hard to play against, and Isagi responds that he is. Noah explains that the core of Snuffy's playstyle is Jujutsu. Snuffy incorporated Jujutsu as part of his playstyle. Core training, biometrics, close combat. Snuffy incorporated the principles of Jujutsu and mixed them with football. Thanks to Jujutsu, Snuffy's already world-class hold-up play and ball retention skills become even more refined, including his passing and scoring. Strictly from a striker's perspective, Noah is stronger than Snuffy. But from an all-round perspective, Snuffy is more versatile. In terms of overall ability, Noah rates Snuffy as the best player in the world. Now how will they defeat him? As we would have guessed, Noah doesn't have an answer. Ubers are moving as a team and effectively launching attack after attack. Meanwhile, Bastard are disorganized. Since most of them can't read their attacks, they get in each other's way. But Noah tells him to hold on for three minutes. Then Snuffy will leave the field and the situation will change. Sometimes being patient will open up a path. This triggers something in Isagi's brain after hearing the word patience. The game restarts with Ubers taking the throw in. Somehow, Hearing the word patience will help Isagi surpass Snuffy. Is Isagi just an idiot or am I just missing something? As Isagi rushes towards the play, 
he calls out to Raichi, asking him if he's willing to die. A new link-up might be in the making. The future is always something that you create for yourself. After talking to Noah, Isagi sees a potential way to turn the game back into Bastard's favor. Inside Isagi's mind, a winning formula emerges. We'll see what happens in the next chapter. An easy job. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.